a troll! Good morning, Patriots. I'm some name that Sam told me to say. Today is Wednesday, February 22nd, and here are your morning announcements. Come out and join our Albemarle High School community during chat today in the small gym. There will be music, art, and spoken word performances to honor black history and culture. AHS students have been working hard all month to create this expression of pride. Come and share in the celebration. Just a reminder from your friends from the Literary Magazine, if you have submitted any writing or art to the Purple Box outside of room 205 to the Lantern Literary Art Magazine, please email ahs.lantern at gmail.com to verify that it has been received. In club news, the AHS Young Republicans and Conservatives will meet in room 153 today during first lunch. We will discuss the upcoming debate with the Young Liberals. National Honor Society nominees, please remember that the selection packets are due mar by March 3rd. No late submissions will be accepted. Spanish Honor Society will, is hosting a dental drive for the International Neighbors Association from February 27th to March 31st to benefit local refugees and immigrants. They will accept toothbrushes, toothpaste, mouthwash, and floss, and donation bins can be found in Senora Johnson and Senora Burris' rooms, as well as near the main office. And now, here's another Oscar update from WPAT Hollywood correspondent Eric. Hi, I'm Eric, and here's another Oscar update. This week, we'll talk about Hidden Figures, a Best Picture nominee about a team of African-American women who were instrumental in the success of the early NASA space program. You might think that a movie about women doing advanced math in 1961 would be as boring as doing advanced math in 2017, but Hidden Figures is about way more than that. This movie is really about the perseverance and determination of women to be successful in a time where all the odds were stacked against their success. Fine against the system created by and for white males, Katherine Johnson, Dorothy Vaughn, and Mary Jackson pushed themselves in the institution to see their immersed talents and intelligence. The movie is driven by great individual performance, namely by those of Tara Hansen and the lead role and Octavia Spencer. They brought their characters to life by combining the passion and the humor that seemed necessary for carrying on when everything seems to be working against you. A supporting performance by Kevin Costner as the NASA executive who finally sees that great intelligence has no color is worth noting. The movie is bright, vibrant, and full of energy with a soundtrack that feels both old school and completely new. It all adds up to a moving experience that you don't usually find in a movie about history. Punctuated by subplots that shows the race to space, technology, and change in social norms, Hidden Figures is about human progress and the fertility of trying to stop people who are driven to move forward. Check it out before the Oscars. You'll be glad that you did. This is Eric. See you next time on Oscar Update. Thanks for that fascinating report, Eric. In sports news, today we'll be celebrating soccer players Hannah Iden and Ayanna Tyler Cooper on signing their national letter of intent to play Division I soccer. Please join us in the celebration in the big gym at 1220. The boys basketball team plays at 7 p.m. tonight in their final home game before they move on to states. The team is playing the number four ranked team in the state, Wakefield, for seeding in the state tournament. This is your last chance to see the Patriots at home this season, and they need support from our great student section. The theme for the game is Patriot Out. Wear red, white, and blue. Be loud and be proud. See you at the game. That's all for now. Have a great day, Patriots.